Hey guys, it's Shauna the Tax Goddess. Um, I wanted to share something just a little bit special with you, something that's near and dear to my heart, uh, the Tax Goddess Scholarship Fund. Now, really what the Tax Goddess Scholarship Fund does is help educate Arizona children. I'm a firm believer that, uh, of course, at some, day, at some point, uh, us Arizona residents will be older Arizona residents and the children will be the ones that are taking care of us. So uh, making sure that we have educated, smart, brand new business owners uh, coming up through the ranks. This is really important to me uh, and of course to Tax Goddess as a whole. So this year I'm super, super pleased that we were able to donate $35,000 to the Tax Goddess Scholarship Fund. And of course, guys, really what I wanted to make sure of is that you guys know uh, what Tax Goddess Scholarship Fund is. So let me bring that up here really quickly. If you have not seen it, the Tax Goddess Scholarship Fund, uh, you can find the page, of course, on taxgoddess.com. Uh, this goes over both where you can donate. This qualifies if you're an Arizona resident. Our scholarship fund does qualify for the private tuition state tax credit. So typically that's upwards of $2,700 for a married couple. But you can also apply for a scholarship. So if you've got a child that is going to a private school here in Arizona, you are welcome to apply to the, the Tax Goddess Scholarship Fund uh, for scholarship. So both of these things, now you guys know that I'm all about business and saving taxes as well as donating. One of the things that I love about the Tax Goddess Scholarship Fund is the ability to get Arizona state level tax credits for this. So one of the other things that you can do is if you have a business, if you have a partnership or an S corp or a C corporation, you can in fact contribute much higher dollar amounts uh, than the minimum, the $2,700 individual level minimum. The On the corporate side, the minimum starts at 5,000, but there is no maximum as long as the dollars are still available at the state of Arizona level. So if you are looking for a place to do some charity, uh, Tax Goddess Scholarship Fund would absolutely love to have your scholarship dollars, uh, your donation dollars, and of course, make sure that your funds are going towards the schools, to the children, uh, rather than the state of Arizona government. So this is a special program. It is unfortunately only available in Arizona at this time. Uh, but yeah, we would absolutely love to work with anyone. If you guys have questions, please don't hesitate to let us know. Just reach out to us at taxgoddess.com. Or of course, you can head over to the website taxgoddess.com and just look for the Tax Goddess Schol Oops, sorry, <laughs> the Tax Goddess Scholarship Fund page. So if you guys have any questions whatsoever, please don't hesitate to ask us. And if you're looking to direct your tax dollars this tax year. Uh, so actually, this is a really cool side point. You can actually do this retroactive. So and at the moment of filming this video today is January 16th of 2021. If you'd like to reduce your 2020 tax bill to the state of Arizona, you can still contribute to this retroactively for the 2020 tax year. So thanks so much, guys. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out. Um, and thank you for not only our donations, but all of the donations that you guys have made to the Tax Goddess Scholarship Fund. We really, really appreciate it. All right. Thanks, everyone. Have a great day. Bye.